Moss Lady here. I just want to do some up close of blossoms. It's overcast, so I think it might work a little better today. I still don't know how to, on my phone, make the screen bigger when I upload it, but I'll figure that out another time. Obviously now this is a peony, and I wish it lasted longer, and the smell is just amazing. These are Wigilia blossoms. It needs to be reshaped. It really and trimmed quite a bit, maybe fertilized, because it just doesn't look as good as other years. There's so many factors. It could be the winter, it could be that it's old, it's an old uh, shrub. Um, a lot of things. I can't remember the last time I fertilized it either, so that could be part of the problem. These are the blossoms of a viburnum. Can't tell you which one it is. I'm pretty disorganized with my labels. I always say I'm going to get more organized, and it doesn't happen. Oh, and there's some. Um, Gypsy moth caterpillar damage. Okay. The forget me nots are going They're so pretty well. They last. Last, and I love how they pop up everywhere. Well, nope. the bunny's been through here. <sighs> At some point, it. It won't chomp as much. And here's the leaves of a kind of tansy. I love the foliage, but I'm not real crazy about the, the yellow. I guess it's okay. It spreads quite a bit. And here's the blossom of sour grass, which is really kind of pretty orchid-like. But that stuff spreads everywhere. It drives me crazy. Let's get rid of that. Bye bye. Okay. There's an allium. Love the seed pods when they dry. And just some ground cover. Lavender starting to fill in. This one's looking a little rough. Okay, can I swoop over here? I'm swooping over to a poppy. I don't like the bright orange ones, but this one is okay. My favorite is the pink, the pinkish ones. And I have other poppies that will come up here at different times. And then this ground cover is like um, a perennial type. Of, it reminds me of Azuretum, the purple fuzzy flowers. And that comes like late summer. So we get the poppy blooms now in some other color. And then that fills in. I'm trying to get some color for all seasons. It is a newer hydrangea. Just thought it was so pretty. And I'm going to be adding some acid to one side and alkaline to the other just so I get a variety of blossoms. And here's some weeds that got a pull. There's a money plant. The pretty purple flowers. And now it's the seed pod stage. and. Eventually it will be white. Try not to step on everything. There's another kind of allium that I like. Um, just, I think it's amazing. 
amazingly beautiful and how it hangs. If I twitch, it's because a mosquito is getting me. <laughs> this is good too to help keep away moles and other pests because they don't like anything onion scented or flavored. Here's the last of this kind of Veronica Grunk. I'm not sure, but it was loaded with these different shades of blue and a little pink. Oh, it's just beautiful. All right, this is Moss Lady for now. Just a little bit of garden. Another forget me not. Okay, bye.